So we built a game. It's kind of like, it's a baseball game. So you have control over this bat using a potentiometer and it, it swings. You use it to hit the ball. So this ball, it's got like, it's really irregular because it's just made out of tape, but ideally you'd have an actual sphere. And, oh, oh, and that's a strike. Sorry, and it comes out of a ball return, which you can't see, but um, both a home run and a strike will empty out into the chute down here below oh, the table. Oh, it unplugged. Which pin was it? Oh, yeah. Go. Okay, you get a home run. Go ahead. Oh, up. Okay. It's a very difficult game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! We got a then home run. It, there's a tap sensor here, so she scored a home run, and it displays one, and now it's displaying much more than that. Oh. So where is it? It's a prototype. Yeah. <laughs> Activate LEDs the first time, but the buttons were really unreliable because just by moving the breadboard, they would activate and deactivate. By moving the button, they would turn on and off the LEDs or not turn the LEDs even if the button was pressed. So that was really hard, and that's why we switched to the potentiometer. 